Did you know that your DNA might have hung around in your biological mother's body for up to 27 years after you were born? Let's talk about some baby genes in action. During pregnancy, cells can travel across the placenta, both to and from the growing fetus. That means that if you're pregnant, some of your cells are flowing into your baby's bloodstream and some of theirs are flowing into yours. And those cells can carry your baby's DNA in them. This phenomenon is called fetal microchimerism. And these cells have been found to persist for up to 27 years. They're not common, less than one in a thousand at their most abundant, but some scientists think they may have effects on maternal health. And it's not just whole cells that can travel between the growing fetus and the mom. Up to 6% of free-floating DNA found in a mother's bloodstream during pregnancy can be fetal DNA. Studies are ongoing, but scientists have found fetal cells and DNA in multiple organs, including the brain, lungs, and even in scar tissue. That might suggest that the DNA helps the mother's body recover after birth. What other cool family genetics do you want us to talk about next?